No, I wanted to ask you because uh, some fans asked me, how did you meet Amy Lee and how the old tour situation started to, to be created? Uh, well, um, she invited us, uh, she was coming to Amsterdam and we were invited to come to see the show. And uh, then we heard we were, uh, we could go backstage and we did. And we just had a conversation with her. And, uh, and the, the, the most surprising thing is sometimes when you meet somebody new, because I never met her on the festival, I saw her passing by once, but on, there wasn't download and she was going to the stage. So it was not the moment to approach someone. And um, I never saw her again on any festival. So they were playing in Amsterdam. They invited us and I, I came over with Robert. And we went backstage and I had this conversation with her that went into the deep immediately. Like a lot of times when you meet somebody, it's just chit chat and which is normal, of course. But I'm not the chit chat kind of person. It's nice, but it, it's for a first time. But I, I rather go about the deeper layer. That's just uh, that's what I like. I like to talk about things that matter most of the time. Uh, so and we did. And we talked about the meaning of life within well, within five minutes. It was really crazy. But we had a nice glass of red wine and we just connected very well. And um, and uh, when I left with Robert, I was like, this, this is the most... This, I expected a lot, but I didn't expect this to happen. You know, not on the first meeting that you meet someone, and so I was really uh, goosebumps because it was that that was really a beautiful conversation. And so uh, we stayed in contact, and and then the, the um, you know just just having contact, and they were planning a new tour, and then the, we were thinking, like, okay, is there something we can do together? Maybe a show or something. And then why not go to, on tour together? And well, we just came back on, to, uh, on tour from the European tour, of course. We were like, okay, uh, uh, going back on tour again. That's that's quite quick. <laughs> but, you know, it's cool. I think it's a, it's a special, you know, it's like, uh, it's nice to have two bands on the bill that uh, all fans probably would like to see because we're more or less in the same genre kind of music. And, um, yeah, I think it's nice for the fans and also for us as persons because it's nice to go on tour with a girl for once. Like, I yeah, and some, <laughs> someone you like. I mean, it's, yeah, it's, also. It, is, it is important, you know, to have someone yeah, the you older like get, around you. Yeah, the older I get, the more important I find it to be on tour with people that I connect with because you're going to be bumping into each other so many times. It yes. should be fun for everyone, you know. So it's a, And that's, that's what I'm looking forward to. Yeah, I cannot even think about touring with someone you don't like. No, it never happened to us, but when I hear about even even bands, you know, not not just like more bands, even yeah. about bands that are having separate tour buses, you know, each member has a separate tour yeah. bus. I it would drive me nuts because just yeah. the idea of like being around someone that I don't like and have to work with these people yeah. and we only meet on stage and we have to put on a smiling face. Yeah. While yeah. in reality I'm like, oh, I hate you, I hate you, I hate you. <laughs> Yeah, there are a lot of big bands actually who did that in the past. Know. You know, the, know. yeah, it's like why are you still performing? You, you know, you already had the fame, you already had the the big, you know, success. Why don't do you drag yourself to a concert if yeah, if you hate each other? Yeah, not only how they do it, but how yeah. they got to that point to become yeah, I mean, also, part how of the band so they like each other. Yeah, I totally. really, I really don't know how how it it can happen but anyway the, the tour has been moved to september now do you think that in september will be possible to tour or i mean you well, move it and then we'll see it's going to be very difficult to be honest but i hope so still there's no definite no but it, it, it is it, if it's realistic i don't know at this point because in the netherlands they say uh, you're not allowed to get together above 100 people until September the 1st, so that's going to be difficult. So, the, yeah, I don't know how we're going to do that. So, we're going to because our tour starts in the beginning of September, and then you know, they might change it, they might not change it. So, it's very close up, everything. So, it's it's um, yeah, the, you know, it's I don't know if it's realistic, but I, I hope so. It's uh, something we'll see, and otherwise, I hope so too. I hope so too, because that means that they will allow shows, and on the 29th, yeah, it exactly, will be exactly. in Milan. So, I want okay. to see. <laughs> Are you, so are you really, there? Okay, are you yes, around? if I'm here and I'm okay. not around, because I mean, I don't know what will happen in September, no. uh, I, will, I will come to see you. Yes, oh, cool. yes, 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 I can't, I can't wait. I can't wait. 